moment. First on five, despite calls to impeach him, Governor Robert Bentley is standing his ground, saying he will not resign over a sex scandal that's looming over his administration. Several state lawmakers want him out, but Bentley isn't budging. He toured a state prison in North Alabama today and wanted to talk about prison overcrowding, but reporters had other questions on their minds. Touring Limestone Correctional Facility today near Huntsville, Governor Robert Bentley seems eager to move on from the sex scandal clouding his administration for nearly two weeks, but he's still being forced to talk about it. I take full, it's, it's me, I did it, I did it. Bentley has admitted to an inappropriate relationship with his top advisor, Rebecca Mason. But he says the relationship was exposed more than two years ago. Just last week, Mason resigned. All of it has been clarified. It's all been addressed. And, and I have put it in the rearview mirror. Now, others have not because it's been obviously brought out now. Bentley is facing one federal and two state investigations about whether any state funds were used to continue his relationship with Mason or whether any ethics laws were broken. Bentley denies breaking the law and is refusing to step down. You know, it's, uh, it's, it's one of those things that I take full control of. I take full, it's, it's me. I did it. I did it. And that's why I ask the people of this state to forgive me, because they are a forgiving people. And they know God's grace. They know God's grace. And I'm not going to take, I, I will not, I, listen, I've made my statement just then. I will not take any more questions about that issue. We're going to talk about prisons now. Okay?